Now, guys, hello, good evening. We are going to tell you how to upgrade the firmware of Image Runner Advance 5240 via USB drive. First, you switch off the machine and insert it USB drive into the mach machine slot. Then, press first 2 and 8 number together and switch on the power switch and hold this 2 and 8 numerics don't remove until the machine will be boot completely and it will be go to the download mode once machine will be show you on the display download mode just wait for a while the menu will be appears on that in that case there are nine menus are there first option will be the most safest and secure the first one will be upgrade auto mode once you will choose the number one on the numeric key machine will ask you it's executed or cancel if you will press zero it will be executed if you will press any other key it will be cancelled so now i am going to upgrade the firmware to press zero once i will press zero the machine starts to copying the firmware from the flash to the machine hard disk. It will take like 5 to 5 minutes. Now guys, see if, if the firmware is going to be copied from USB to the machine. It will be go through like that. So you have to wait and make sure do not cut the power from the main switch or the from the power cable. Otherwise, your control board may be damaged. So, be careful while you are going to be update your uh, firmware. Just wait for a while until the machine will give you the message or it will give you the sign for restart the printer. See guys, now the machine will be shut down and it will be reboot automatically. Once this procedure from flash to data copy into the hard disk, machine will be restarted now if you will see the machine will be reboot and starting again see now the machine is copying the data from hard disk to the main control board it will take also like 5 to 10 minutes once it will be finished this procedures I will come back to again now guys we are come back see now the machine is already copy the software from hard disk to the machine control board after it will be restart again once it will be restart and the menu will be come to the normal home button you can see the copy scan and the other functions will be appears so now just we will wait for machine booting again in normal board because the firmware it's already update on that model so guys if you like our videos and support support you must subscribe our channel and like our videos if you want to get more updates related with the new advanced models for canon you should have to subscribe to get new videos thanks a lot Bye.